Machine capacity information for each machine is stored on each line of the factory. Machine capacity information for each machine is stored on each line of the factory. The machine and line information can be pulled directly from VPLAN. There is information on what types of feeders each part can be delivered on, along with the total number of components available for each part. All valid feeders for a part can be defined. Here is a list of the 64 work orders that we need to assign to one of our four lines. The challenge is to determine which order should be assigned to which line. The multi-line mode allows LX to determine the correct assignment of work orders to lines. On completion of the analysis, each work order is assigned to a line. There is an estimate for the overall time needed per line and how many groups each line needs. Now we can review each line in turn. Based on the required product quantities, insufficient parts are available to fulfill all work orders. Let's update our stock quantities to see if more parts have arrived. Now we have enough parts to complete the work orders for line 4. Now we auto calculate when each work order will go into production. As we only have a single group, there is only one setup at the start for all products. This group can be sent back to VPLAN for detailed optimization and program creation. If we need to fix a number of feeders to create a static setting, LX can quickly determine the high running parts. Just add the products to be considered. Then sort based on the descending number of total placements per part. Decide how many feeders to fix. Then pass the results directly back to VPLAN as our static setting. LX provides fast assignment for build planning purposes as well as providing the ability to quickly react to unforeseen circumstances.